fuck cause I don't ride in a huge ass truck. Oh, welcome everybody to the hottest show on the entire internet. It is fucking Mayhem Mania, and I am, as always, your pal in the mainstream media, the only one who knows the rules to Mayhem Mania. And joining me tonight is our old pal, Sorgatron. Yes, our guests have been put through enough, so way they have left, but uh, it's just us to After contemplate two games, everything. That yes. was enough. Yes. We did ask a lot of them tonight, though. So it was We did fantastic. ask a lot, but... Wow, what what a performance they put in during Mayhem Mania. By the way, look at the look at the look at the thumbnail. I love it. <laughs> One of them looking it's at the spinning the wheel. wheel. That is actually perfect for this. I'm capturing that for later. It's always good to have so. our guests mm-hmm. spin the wheel. That's right. That's it's more right. fun that they way. They took it seriously. I really appreciate that. You know, uh, we I think we learned a lot about our guests tonight in we general. Did. So. I, so so in case you're just tuning in on um, on Tuesday's Wrestling Mayhem show, we had two. Um, first of all, two wrestling mayhem show royalty mm-hmm. uh, in Doc Remedy and Mayhem Missy come on, mm-hmm. and they also played Mayhem Mania. And then we had two bona fide professional wrestling stars, Andrew Palace and Katie Arquette, were here, mm-hmm. and they also made moves in Mayhem Mania. Mm-hmm. And um, Brandon and KC phoned one in. Woo! And I'm getting tired, Sorg, so let's run through these matches here. Here's the card as it stands right now. AJ Styles versus Shinsuke Nakamura versus Finn Balor, created by Brandon and KC. Ilya Dragunov versus King Corbin, important distinction, created by Doc Remedy. Cody and his dog Pharaoh versus Roman Reigns and Solo Sokoa, created by Andrew Palace. Rhea Ripley versus Chelsea Green, created by Katie Arquette. Becky Lynch versus Bianca Belair, created by Mayhem Missy. Thea Hale versus Nikki Cross, created by DP. DIY versus Giovanni Vinci and Ludwig Kaiser versus Tyler Bate and Pete Dune versus the Creed Brothers, created by Brandon and KC. And finally, Ava versus Randy Orton, created by Andrew Palace. Andrew Palace made the big brain move mm-hmm. and switched people inside the card. You can also see here, we have added a couple people to space jail. Mm-hmm. Logan Paul has been in there for a bit. And now courtesy of uh, Katie and uh, palace winning the uh, mayhem wed game. They won two tickets to space jail. Katie sent Pat McAfee to space jail and Andrew palace. The ever cautious move sent Mordecai to space jail and i can't blame him that's a good move um so that's where things stand right now sorg <clears throat> very excited to point this out our first match has graduated holy crap and i am stunned i can't believe this is happening mm-hmm. but aj styles versus shinsuke nakamura versus finn balor survived three rounds wow. without being altered in any way and this match, it graduates to the super card. And now Brandon and KC gets to come back next week and make another match mm. and send somebody else to Space Jail. Mm. Space Jail's filling up fast. Johnny Michael Enrico's going to be on next week, and he's going to send somebody to Space Jail. Mm-hmm. I was worried we weren't going to put a lot of people into Space Jail, but it is filling it's up. It's building up. It's building it's up. It's starting to fill up. And... um. Sorry, I, I don't know what else to say. I can't I believe this match graduated. This is more shocking than when I ridiculed the um, the Shield versus the New Day, and that <laughs> match graduated, and I mocked it and uh, told uh-huh. everybody we got better things to do yeah. with with uh, Rollins, Ambrose, and Reigns, and it just it just made it. Um, re- thoughts. Uh, it's a good match. Nobody wants to touch it. There's a, there was a lot, I think there was a lot more happening to distract people in this lineup. There is a dog on the card right there now. There is a dog on the court right now. People want to handle and it's that. Not just, and, and it's not just going away. And there's, I mean, the, there's there. the dog and then there's Rhea Ripley as a whole. Uh, apparently people have strong feelings about Jade. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so I, I was kind of surprised nobody touched Thea and Nikki Cross this week. Right. Um, and, but this dog. This dog is. This dog is. I'm not going to say the dog is a problem, um, but the dog is a factor. 
this the year. The dog is a player. Yes. And you know what? The, the, you know what? If you're not careful, this dog's going to end up at Space Jail if it <laughs> slips, slips off this card. Because people, they'll be sending it to the pound. At oh, this, I'm sorry. No, no, I'm, no. Sorry. I'm sorry. Space Jail presented by Slim Jim. Yes. So. Yes. Though, is it the Space <laughs> Kennel at that point? It is or? the Space Kennel. Okay, okay. We will send Pharaoh to the Space Kennel. That's a great idea. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the Space Kennel from Jeez. hell. The Space oh. Kennel from hell. Oh, no. <laughs> Holy have, moly. Man. Yeah, we had, um, I mean, we learned a lot about people playing the Mayhem Wade game. Mm -hmm. We learned a lot during the Mayhem Wade game, but we learned a lot about, we we learned a lot during Mayhem Mania, too. I can't even believe Andrew Palace knows who Mordecai is. (laughs) Um, I mean, he must have been like two years old when that whole thing happened. That was like, I feel like, that was literally like four months of wwe tv and then it was over and never spoken of again i feel like mordecai was on a promotion with him if i'm not mistaken i'm, I'm gonna check my my stuff here well I, I mean if memory serves they did like like two months of oh my god why am i yawning oh sorry folks um they did like two months of vignettes for mordecai mm-hmm. he showed up he squashed some dude and then he had a match against the undertaker and then he lost and it was over and he was never seen again. Mm-hmm. And well, this so, is like twenty years ago. You, we, but Andrew like, Palace remembers. We we I mean Kevin Thorne is somebody that we interviewed on the show. Yeah. Right. Mm-hmm. Uh, there had been a reason uh, coming to. Oh, he was in town for House of Hardcore. Oh. Which was a co-brand with uh, uh with Andrew Palace's home promotion. So that would be why mm. he's very aware of Kevin Thorne. At the very least. It felt like sending him to Space Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently he didn't have a good experience Guess with not. him. So, there so you what's go. up with Doc Remedy and uh, King Corbin? Uh, no, that seems on brand for him. I mean, there's got to be some lore. I can't some remember. Some mayhem lore. I can't remember. Um, what's his hang up? I, 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 mean, I mean, Corbin. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Corbin is a war horse. I can see the appreciation there, right? I, I mean... Workhorse? Uh he, he's a he's a utility player. He is I mean, think about all the things he's been involved with over the years. I mean <sighs> He's tired. Oh man, he's tired. He's tired. Sorry, folks. I got through the entire show and didn't yawn once and mm-hmm. I know I'm having mm-hmm. trouble. Um he's like um I, I just I, I'm I, I'm 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 not gonna drag, you know, King Corbin. I mean he you know Mm-mm. He's a lovely person. I mean, if you're going to pick an iteration, I think that's a good one. Yeah, that's the one to go with. But um, I just i am not sure why Doc is so uh, so fixated on him. This is very much like when uh, Larry couldn't let go of Bart Gunn. Um, mm-hmm. that, that lasted for years. God, I forgot his name was Larry. Yeah, everyone has Bart an Gunn. agenda. Mm-hmm. Here in Mayhem Mania, I think some of these moves rubbed people the wrong way. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Tina didn't look very happy in the chat tonight. No, no, no. Uh, uh, oh, her some... Ilya Okada match. He literally swapped Kazuchika Okada for King Corbin. I mean, mm-hmm. that's that's that going to upset a few people. That hurts. So. <laughs> I, think, I think Corbin gets bounced out. He's going to Space Joe somehow. That's a prediction. He might end up in Space Joe. Yeah. There's a lot yeah. of Space Joe candidates on this card. Somebody's going to say where you never again. But yeah. Oh, my God. Can't believe it. Styles, Nakamura, and Balor. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, we're going we to have to crack open them uh, that graphics package that uh, Team Hammerfist has been putting together for us. And uh, Yeah, Team yeah, Hammerfist. We're good and, for that. Uh, thanks to Team Hammerfist for the enhanced Mayhem Mania <laughs> intro. <laughs> yeah, we'll see, if we, we'll see if we get a takedown for that one. The biggest <laughs> star in Hollywood, Dwayne The Rock Johnson. <laughs> And then now iconic. Yes. Take a look. <laughs> Take a look. Oh my gosh, Memed that is for all time. Thank you for uh, the Rock's uh, PowerPoint presentation for that one. So, all right. Well, I think that wraps it up. We better get the hell out of here. That's right. We got some more fun stuff to talk about. That's so. right. That's right. Let's roll on out. Um, hey, keep up with the lore. Check out the Wrestling Mayhem Show Facebook group. Go to WrestlingMayhemShow dot com. Tell your friends. Send your feedback. Tell us how you feel about Pharaoh the Dog just being an unmovable object on this card this year. Mm-hmm. Everybody loves Pharaoh. Or much movable. <laughs> send us your likes. Send us your dislikes. Engage with us. Do whatever you got to do. But most importantly of all, stay 
Hemi. Hemi. Truck, I pop a wheelie on the street bike Get yeah, his fucking dude is nuts and who we trust The dude who bust and move it up I've used the stuff to cruise and rush Booze and blunts fucked up What do you want? This my life And this my right to take advantage of the drugs I'm giving to escape into a greater state of living I'm just racing to the